everyone. Welcome to Living the Light and Love. This is a timeless you versus them reading for all signs. This reading is for all signs. This is a timeless you versus them reading. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, um, look in the description box to um, get the email to schedule a private reading. Also, if you like my energy, my vibe, you feel like I am the reader for you, hit the subscription link to show some support along with the notification bell so that you are notified when new videos are posted. Most of all, watch the video all the way through and hit that thumbs up image to help this video circulate so that it may reach someone else that needs clarity, enlightenment, and guidance pertaining to their situation and love. If um, your energy will be on top, your partner's on the bottom. If you find that the, the energies are vice versa, apply it as if it's to your story or apply it to the energy that it fits. With that being said, I am going to start your reading. Spirit, what is the energy for my top reader? I'm my top reader, my top viewer. <laughs> for the person that's watching this video, what is the energy for the person? Okay, so we have the Eight of Wands, the person that is watching the video. Eight of Wands in reverse. All right. We have the Chariot, Cancer's energy. We have Judgment, Scorpio's energy. Someone could be dealing with a Cancer or Scorpio. And then we have the Two of Cups. Okay. Let's get your partner's energy out here. I'm hearing the number three. The number three. All right. Let's cut this deck. And get your partner's energy. Spirit, what is the energy of the top person's? What is the energy for the top person's partner? What is the energy for my viewer's partner? That's easier to say. <laughs> so we have the Page of Cups. All right. The Page of Cups. Why is this Page of Cups here? Okay, we have a jumper. The Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles. Why is this Three of Pentacles here? Okay. We have the... What is this? The Eight of Cups. The Eight of Cups. And let's get one more out. Why is this Eight of Cups here? All right. The lovers, Gemini energy. Okay. So, um, all right, so let's see what's going on. You, the viewer, you, you may want some, um, communication to come in quickly. You want something. Something is moving too slow. It could be communication. It could be action being taken. But it's moving slow. Like a new beginning is not coming in as quickly as you want. I feel like you, you may be feeling or thinking that your partner has moved on. Or... It's taking too long for this person to come in to reconcile because you have this eight of wands in the reverse. So something is not coming in as quickly. Someone's not taking action as quickly as you want them to. You want them to move in so that there could be um, a second chance at this union. You want to rekindle things. You want... Um, 
to do things over again. But it's not coming in as quickly as you want. You want this second chance because you love this person. You feel like they love you. You feel like this second chance will allow you two to see eye to eye. It will open up um, a chance for give and take. Reciprocity. Possibly a pregnancy or a baby. You could be pregnant now. If you are a female, there could be a baby here or children involved. But I'm seeing you and this person seeing eye to eye. I feel like there is um, mutual love here, but it's, it's just taking more time than you expected it to. Your partner with the page of cups. I feel like your partner is willing to come in and offer this cup of love to have this new beginning, to take your relationship to a higher level of commitment because they do love you. They do want to put in work, put in an effort to have success in this union. But with this Eight of Cups, they may need to turn their back and walk away from someone or something else. They may need to move out from where they are living if you two are not living together. They need to move on from something in order for this new beginning to come in, this second chance to come in, because they do love you with this lover's card. They do love you deeply, but they have a decision to make in love. Someone has a decision to make in love, and I feel like this has something to do with children. So let's see. What is blocking this union? Spirit, what is blocking this union? The strength card. Someone doesn't have the strength to leave. Your partner doesn't have the strength to leave. Yeah, they may have lots of responsibilities, obstacles, things that are weighing them down, and it's causing them to feel overwhelmed. What is the mutual energy? Love. There is love here. There is definitely love here. That's why this person is taking their time to come coming back in. <coughs> I feel like this person is taking their time. They want to make a move. This person wants to make a move. Okay. This person wants to make a move, but they don't want to look like a fool. They're uncertain of how things will turn out between you two. So I feel like they bread from you with this page of cups. They want to turn their way from being a player with the six of wands in the reverse. This person doesn't want to be a player anymore. They don't want to give to multiple people anymore. I feel like this person is trying to change their ways. Yeah. This person is trying to change their ways. They're not taking action right now with anyone. They're releasing a third party. Not wanting to start over right now. Because they're tired of feeling overwhelmed. Tired of feeling... Like, this whole situation is causing them to feel, um, they were feeling overwhelmed and weighed down. They're tired of feeling like that. So, I feel like this person is taking their, they took a step back and now they're taking their time. Mm-hmm. Because they know they need to walk away from someone. But in them walking away, this person may have some type of financial hardship if they, or experience some type of financial hardship if they walk away. Yeah, they know they're going to cause heartbreak. There's going to be, be confliction, arguing, fighting, back and forth. So, <clears throat> I feel like they're waiting. They're waiting for something to come in. Could be waiting on more finances. Because they know if they leave now, there's going to be a, it, it, there will be a tower moment. So, this person may have restricted you and blocked you with this two of swords at the bottom of the deck. Because they know your worth. They know that you're not going for anything.
Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I feel like there's distance between you two. There is distance, but this person is going to take action to come in because they love you and they're going to come in. They may come in with um, a gift or something because um, they want to start things over, something more stable, and they want victory with you. They don't. This person doesn't want to let this union go. They don't want to just turn it away and let, let this go just like that. But they definitely need to walk away from someone someone else. What did that card go? Oh, I hate when a card flip over. Can I have a love oracle card? Spirit, can I have a love oracle card? Yeah, you two may not be speaking at this time. Mm-hmm. See? Separation. Separation. Someone is um separation. And someone could be thinking about this person could be thinking about coming towards you, moving towards you with their boat. They may be traveling towards you. Yeah, because you make them happy. You're their joy. You're their paradise. They have to leave a karmic relationship behind and heal their heart before this can come to fruition. So this is a timeless reading again for everyone. Thank you for watching. This is you versus them. Please comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe with your family and friends. Hit the notification bell. Be safe. I'm sending love, light, peace, and healing energy. Thank you so much to all of my subscribers as well as the new subscribers and subscribers to be. I appreciate you all. I'll see you next time. Enjoy the rest of your week. Bye.